So in this video, I'll be showing you how to create these slot together decorations like this hanging star or a freestanding Christmas tree. You can apply this to create any slot together items you want really. So to get started, I'm just going to delete these and open up the shape panel, open up basic shapes. I'm going to choose this star here. Then I'm going to resize that so it's about 100 millimeters high. I'm going to align it horizontally and align it to the bottom. From here, we need a rectangle. I'm going to create a rectangle. I'm going to unlink this aspect ratio so we can alter these separately. I'm going to choose this one to be a hundred millimeters high. And because I'll be using three millimeter material, we want this to be three millimeters wide. And again, we need to align horizontally and align it to the bottom. So it's in the center of the star. Now we're going to need two of these stars, one with a slot at the top and one with a slot at the bottom. So I'm just going to copy and paste, and move this over. Now we can look at this one first. Now, we want the slot to be about halfway on each star. So I can change that to be 50 millimeters. There we have a rectangle, which is half the way of the star. If we select both, we'll need to use one of these operations, but we need to make sure that the slot hole is completely over the star. So we want to get this double arrow, not the cross arrow with four, we need the double arrow so we can just scale it up just in this axis here, just so it's over the star. Then we can select both and use subtract. That then creates the slot hole three millimeters wide for your material and halfway down of the star. And we can do that again. But when we alter the height, it always goes from the top left hand side of the bounding box. So we just need to make sure that everything is on the bottom of the board. So again, we are going to align to the bottom. Choose the rectangle and choose 50 and align to bottom. Again, I'm going to zoom in, select the rectangle and come down until we see the double arrow, just so we can scale it in the Y axis. Then we can select both again and choose subtract. There we have one side of the star for the top, one side of the star for the bottom. Now, when these slot together, we also need a loophole. Now we can't really put a loophole on this side because we need it to slot in. So we need a loophole here. So we need a circle, click and hold shift, choose about four millimeters. Then I'm going to zoom in and we need to get it so it's just in the center. We can select both and choose horizontal align just to make sure. I'm just going to move that up a touch. And then we're going to go to outline by two millimeters and confirm. Then we need to select both circles and make compound path and select the star and the loop and choose unite. And there we have a slot together star. So just finishing up, we have the slot together star and when slotted together, you may need to add a little bit of glue for it on this side so it doesn't fall out. And here's the example of the slot together freestanding Christmas tree. Well, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. 
Leave any questions you have in the comments, and I will see you in the next video.